Slither to Slytherin to Hitherin. That's right. That's what AKA I call S2H. S2H. You no, know, he's been marking the Meta Knights for yeah. about as long as this character has been alive. Smash 4 too? Oh, yeah. Brawl too? I believe so. Did he play Brawl? Uh, he did play Brawl, yeah. All right, if he didn't, that's tragic. Because that would be I the mean, one that game. <laughs> that'd be the, that's the game, right? Like, yeah. He's yeah. the character. <laughs> that is a V character. Ooh, yeah, he's going to mash out. Uh, but, you know, he's been he's been making moves with Meta Knight ever since pretty much like the iteration of this his character came to life. Meta Knight is actually a dope character. But like the thing about Meta Knight that's like a little bit kinda, you know, whack playing him is like either you hit your sick win condition, like, you know, combo that just kills uh -huh. them, or yeah, you kind of just play neutral for a long time and you don't get a kill, so. I mean, because yeah. when you think about Meta Knight's game plan, it's all about getting that conversion, that combo starter mm -hmm. that's going to either lead to a big damage yep. or to a kill. That's right. And honestly, it, there's only like three tools that Meta Knight has that does that. Dash act. What are the other ones you're thinking? Uh, down throw. got fair and down throw. Yeah, makes sense. Yeah, in terms of obviously, oh, okay. In terms of obviously getting a kill, you know, one thing he does have that he could use against a character like Inkling that likes to recover low is he could use the tornado and like kind of hover around the ledge and then throw out the tornado when Inkling tries to recover it with the up yeah, And that's something that we, like when Abadango was playing a lot of Mennonite, that was something he was a big fan of. Uh, but yeah, I mean, we'll see, man. Especially with the new mechanic that Tornado has, oh, just God. like instead oh. of like sucking you in, and having multi hit, right. it just like knocks you away instantly. Uh, but we typically don't see that move come out from S2H. Right. We're more likely to see like a drill setup or uh, maybe some shuttle loop bait. That's his. Uh, that, that that that's just his play style. Or? Yeah, that's just you know. Yeah. I mean, when you've been you shuttle looping people for over ten years, it just feels right. It just you know that's that's your bread and butter right well. there. I respect it. Yeah, right now, I mean, this has been a very neutral game at the first off. There it is, the back air on uh, on Slither 200's Meta Knight. Honestly, like, okay, so yo, in, uh, in Smash 4, I remember Meta Knight was actually one of the lightest characters in the whole game. I <laughs> we're coming on the right side of the stage. Is that still the case? Is, that, uh, is, uh, is Meta Knight still super light? He's light, but he's not, you know, with oh. the addition of, like, Pichu and, of course, like, Jigglypuff. He's not the lightest. Got it, got it, got it. But I honestly, like, even Fox is lighter than Meta Knight now. Ooh. Wow, that up smash KOing. I feel like without the help of, so it's like two things, right? One, it's the ink, and two, it's the rage. When you're yes. at 140, you can expect things to kill like a good 10 to 20 percent sooner. So. That's true, that's true. Just caught me off guard because, you know, then I being light, like we were just saying, like, we're oh, yeah. we got oh, the tornado. Get him. Oh, the forward air. Forward air, and it does it. Wow. Okay, it's even game. I mean, just getting that dash attack, and that was really what led to that conversion of taking that stock on XX. Right. Liking everything I've seen so far. The rabbit jab, probably not what he wanted. Yeah, here's the up throw up air. Yeah, you can tell Meta Knight's like this. Look how far he goes from Inkling's up throw. Oh, he almost good. goes out of range of the uh, of the full jump up here. Okay. I like the retreat back, trying to bait something out from Exact. The scars Exact, not falling for it. Uh, it's too oh, oh, gets oh, grounded. No. Okay, nice. Yeah, good mash, good mash, good mash. And uh, man, this is ah, it's gonna do it. For yeah, someone who gets it. chased with up airs, you know that's something that S2H is used to. Wow, uh, yeah, he uses that. That was a, uh, you know, fighting fire with fire, using his, uh, <laughs> his own medicine against him. All right, so, Exact's clutching on game one, S2H with some stuff. I wouldn't be surprised if we see S2H run it back. Uh, I know he's not a fan of Yoshi's. But it makes sense. Yeah, it's a good stage against Angling for sure. You take away some of the threat of their like platform combos, just makes them more. And then Meta Knight can still do this Meta Knight stuff. That's All true. right, so game two here, S two H, smoke two coins. <laughs> Yeah, and he's right? still going to be able to utilize all the horizontal combos that, that Meta Knight has that is in Smash Ultimate. Or, or vertical combos. No, horizontal Oh, combos. yeah, yeah, you mean like off the stage. Yeah, yeah that yeah, too. Yeah. Actually, both. Yeah. <laughs> kind of, right? You're like, right, you're right. Yeah. This <laughs> can, can kill you both ways, honestly. Like <laughs> You're never, you're not yeah, safe yeah, anywhere, yeah, apparently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, here we go. Get some damage. Dash attack. Oh, he goes for that. Might, oh, he actually gets the follow-up. He actually might have been looking for a dash uh, up smash, though. But uh, not sure. Depends on if he plays with tap jump on or off. All right, up throws, going for the nair fair. Yeah, not usually a true combo, but Ooh, he actually traded. grounded nice. Yeah, he that traded was with a, with XX, and that was a heads up play to go for the uh, to go for the downer there. You know, because they traded. Oh, even flashing with the roller, but still like, putting XX in that roller animation. Let him, you know, get punched just a little bit, just, just a little bit. 
just a little bit. Okay. Can I ask you a question? Yeah, what's up? Um, so, okay, so in, in, in Smash 4 in particular, like, having a range made it a lot easier if you're a character like, you know, say, some Zero Suit, Bayonetta, yeah. Meta Knight 2, right? If you're trying to get a KO off of, like, you know, like, early percent KOs where you kind of ladder them up to the top and oh, kill sure. them on top, right? Yep. Is range like that in this game? It's not as prominent. It's not as prominent, right? It's it's almost, it's similar to, like, level 2 range. Uh, got it, got it, got it. Smash it. Helps a little bit. Yeah. It, it helps, I mean, especially in certain situations, it can definitely be what, what makes a difference in a match. Right. It's not going to be like, you're at 0%, I it's can not still end kill you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anything, stale moves are back. Yes. From Brawl, yeah. Okay, get Exax, uh, you know, able to get that kill. SDH kind of overextending a little bit on the recovery. Maybe should have gone to the ledge. Oh, gets a drive down with the back here. Exax still able to recover. It looked like he wasn't pushing any buttons for it, a second. Yeah, I was going to say, it? it looked like maybe he thought he had a double jump and then did he? And then he was like, oh, God, I got an uppie, and then did. And then it was fine. Uh, so maybe a little hesitation. Yeah, I don't know. But no panic coming out from Exax, so no. definitely Mar top player. Mark of a top player, man. All right, so let's, oh, okay, yep. Dimensional K back on the level. Meta Knight with some tricks off stage for her. All of his beam moves able to help recover. Literally up, up air. Literally all of them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. Makes sense. Give him the respect. Says, you know what? I think you're gonna tech this one for the roller. Because usually, if you think they're gonna miss the tank, you just want to run the jab, right? Yeah, that's very true. You get yeah. a reset, and then you get some. Or you put a lot of ink on it. You can do either. Or. Yeah, either. Or. All right, but yeah, like this has been a this is a struggle situation for the airs. The tornado doesn't KO. Then he gets the weak hit. Oh, jumping over that splash back. Ooh, wow, he goes all the way. Meta Knight can do that. Yeah, he can. But, I mean, so can anyone, so. That's true. Meta Knight is able to stall down there, so if he is expecting Exax to, to go low, he can pretty much put, like, a, a danger zone down there that Exax has to respect. Yeah, makes sense, makes sense. I like how Exax is going to protect his rollers. Covering a lot of options, honestly, with a lot of these, uh, these rollers he's going for when he's trying to catch the landing. Oh, oh no! Oh, okay, he but Exax missing the punish. Miss the punish. Miss the punish. Miss the punish. That's gonna do it. Nice. I like that he walked into it. Sometimes you know you like dash because you're like antsy or whatever, and you dash too far, you don't get the strong hitbox. And now Exax up pretty much a full stock. Not even pretty much. He actually is up a full stock. That's right. Now uh, Swh able to land that dash attack. Not able to convert like he would like to though. Mm -hmm. Now Exax answering right back with an up throw of his own. I was, I was thinking that this could be a dash tag upper opportunity for S2H. This game, man, he hasn't had any, you know, that, that, that game one, right? He had that, that clutch second stop with the, uh, the, the the horizontal combo. But in this game, I haven't really seen any of it. And now, Exax is definitely playing a lot safer when it comes to those ledges. He's not giving S2H an opportunity. Even right there, S2H was only able to get two up airs into the cellar Oh, yeah, wow, what an up air. Actually, kind of a crazy situation. Exact's gonna make it out of pools in the winner's side.